the holy God and if you'll put your trust in him he will never let you down never never let you down praise God I'd like to ask Sister Deb to come bless us with the song Brother Jonathan get ready I'd like to introduce to you Sister Deb good morning everybody um as I was sitting back there, uh, you know, I was just thinking about how our Lord felt about us as his kids. You know, I think he has a little bit of sadness that we've not done everything we knew to do as a church. I think, I think personally that we have failed our Lord in getting the gospel out there, the true gospel out there. There's a lot of junk out there that's not doing anybody a bit of good. But I uh, challenge the Christians today. Uh, if you have any, if you have any uh, doubt that you are a Christian, you know, if you have any doubt that you're where you need to be, I've got one place for you to look, and that's the Word of God. You start reading that Word, and it'll build you up. And as Brian says, it gives you an inheritance of blessings and protection and mercy and love. Praise God. You know, let's start uh, shining ourselves up a little bit with the Word of God, you know, because, uh, you know, the end is coming. And like Brenda said, that poor little fellow that she was trying to witness to, he turned his Jesus away. I had a fellow once too, Brenda, that done the same thing. He said, ah, oh, said the grave is the end of everything felt like I needed to, uh, you know, say something else to him, but he was, he, he started even cursing, and I, I, and I asked, you know, my Lord, I said, you know, what should I do, and he said, you don't have to defend me, Danny, you don't have to defend me, just tell people about, about me, so the last words I said to that 80-something year old gentleman is, I'll pray for you, sir. You know, you stop and think. Get a reality check about things, guys. It's This isn't going to continue day in and day out. One day our Lord will come back and get his people. You know, and, uh, you know, ones that's left is going to be in great despair. Praise God, great despair. So, you know, open your hearts up today. Let the Lord come in. Let the Word of God feed you grow spiritually and go from one glory to the next and I'm a, I, I can verify this because I have you know the closer uh, I have gotten to the Lord is due to the fact that I got closer to his word and I developed a relationship praise God that's where it's at so open your eyes up to your heart today and let the Lord come in 